Okay. Okay, so hey, uh, welcome. And my name is Tilan Stregar. I have been part of Fildo team for the past two years. And I will show you today why it is important for you to have a good Fildo profile. We will do this video step by step in case you will miss anything. Uh, we will upload it later on our YouTube channel and you will be able to check it out again. So we will start by opening the browser. Okay. So first step would be join us. Uh, now you have many options to choose from. Uh, that depends on what kind of profile you want to create. Uh, but today we will create a profile uh, of a young footballer, fo footballer Albi Gulena, uh, who already attended the field of trial and we helped him to spend a year in Spain in Football Academy and we are now exploring options for him to join a club uh, after the Corona pandemic will be over. So we will choose the option of a player. So now you put in the basic information about yourself. which are the first name, last name, email address. And the password which, which you can change uh, later if you forget it. Create profile. Uh, and what you need to do now is to, to confirm the email address and the first step is completed. So just log in. Now this is the dashboard. So first step uh, is the profile picture. Uh, when choosing the profile picture, it is mandatory to show your face, either in motion of the game or just uh, a basic portrait picture. Uh, we really advise you not to put on a profile picture with a Barcelona shirt with Messi written on the back. Uh, that is really not appropriate or not, not appropriate thing to do because uh, your profile representing you is representing you and not any other player. Uh, I just took an example, an example of Messi, any other player is not suitable as well. So uh, we will put profile picture. So moving forward, once again, um, you have to fill in the basic information about yourself, which is the first name, last name, and also the screen name, which can be typed directly after uh, .com slash uh, the screen name. And uh, it's usually the first uh, or, or last name of, your, of yourself with uh, some number. Make sure you check the availability uh, if the screen name is not already in use and just choose it. So next we have the date and birth. Uh, we suggest you start with the year because it will be easier for you. So here we have age. December. Um, you start with the year you were born, after that you move to the month and, and, the, and the last is the date. So because the, the date order is year, 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 month, month, day. After that, uh, we have country. So because Albi is from Albania, we will choose Albania. Uh, if you have uh, any problems, just click the first, uh, the first letter of your country so you don't have to scroll all the way down. The same we, we will do with the, uh, with the passport. In case you have a new European pass, passport from European Union, uh, just click here and mark it so that the clubs and agents and everybody else will know. So then we move to height and weight. Height is uh, measured in centimeters and uh, weight is measured in kilos. So we have 177, 70. So now you have, you have to check either you are currently uh, without a club or you have a club at the moment. Uh, after that, 
uh, you will have the three possible level uh, uh, yeah okay so if you have if you're about uh, without a club you will have uh, just to choose the position but if you have a club you choose the level at which you are competing at the moment the country and the current club current club is position striker um, young player okay uh, the last thing we have um, here is the transfer market and soccer race links and this is the only an option with for the players who already uh, have their own links on those two platforms uh, so if you have them just uh, uh, copy the links from uh, browser and pass them here and make sure you f don't forget to press save okay we move on to the attributes now you can see a picture of the football pitch on the screen so the first position is your natural position uh, primary position you will click and will be marked uh, in yellow and the second position you will click is will be your secondary position and it will be marked in gray color okay and after that you choose up to five skills you have here skills uh, which at which you are good at and always be honest and choose the skills that are mandatory for your position uh, for example you will not mark dribbling or if you are a goalkeeper on central defender so we will do aggression dribbling finishing technique and pace okay so now we move up to step four which is a promo video and as you know promo video is a video of your highlights from previous seasons uh, promo video is a mandatory thing which uh, if you want to be seen uh, clips in the video must not be older than one year so if you have a promo video from for example 2017 2018 then it's probably time to get a new one uh, video is a must-have uh, because this is something you can present to the agents and scouts and make sure uh, you have quality footage and also be careful about the length of the video because if your video will be too long the person watching it will lose interest if your footage is just like passing the ball in an open play and always uh, mark yourself in the video with the circle uh, for this you will probably need some uh, basic editing skills or you can always ask somebody to help you or in the worst case you can contact us so what you will do is upload the video firstly on youtube or vimeo and just copy the link copy the link and press save successfully okay so now we move up to career history this is a section where you will fill out the statistics from previous seasons it is always good to have filled as many seasons as you have played so that agents know that you are not that you are in the training and uh, playing process uh, so you will probably start with uh, from the this year uh, for example, for Albi, we have uh, category league. Level is the uh, first division. Country is Albania. Club. So next, uh, you put on how many matches you played at. So because of this season has been has been a little bit short. I'll just put for now this my yellow card with your red cards so you have how many matches you played at how many goals you scored how many assists you, you made and yellow and red cards um but because many of those <coughs> because many of those leagues cannot be tracked you will always find players who will put in unrealistic numbers uh here you need to be fair to yourself and also to the whole football world because if you put out if you put in that you scored for example 30 goals and made 25 assists as a right back, agents will probably know, uh, not get in touch with you. Uh, so here you need to be realistic because it is easy to find uh, fake information. After this, you will just click add and uh, 
the season will appear here. So you can repeat for as many for as many seasons as you have participated in. Also, you have you can choose if you either played for any national team or any cup games or whatever. You can always uh, do it the same procedure. And don't forget to press save. So next we have recommendations. Um, this is a section where you can request recommendations from your teammates, coaches, friends. Uh, credible people and credible recommendations are the best uh, social proof of your football. So you just post the link, uh, which is the screen name of Fildo, of Fildo profile of your coach or a teammate. Uh, who, but they also have to be uh, on Fildo platform. And you just send invite, and once they accept, uh, the, it will add automatically pop up on your profile. So for now, we will skip test your performance and we will go directly to upload photos uh, because that will, we will leave it for the final step. Uh, so you, everybody knows that, always, that we always get attracted to something we see. Therefore, it is mandatory that you put in photos of yourself in action in order to get noticed. The photos can be from the training pitch, uh, from the match. Uh, they can be in a club colors, on uh, colors of a national team. Basically, put in as many photos uh, as you can. Uh, basically, I put as many as you can. Of course, you need to understand that the quality of the photos need to be good in order for the, for the photo to bring attention. And also, one important thing is to circle yourself in a group photos so that people at your profile don't waste too much time looking for you or uh, what will happen in uh, most of the cases, they will just uh, close the photo and move to another profile. So every time you upload a photo, you put save photo. Just repeat the process. These are all photos from matches, as you can see. Okay. We have enough. So now we have social media and uh, press. Uh, you know that in today's times, everybody is on Instagram scrolling or chatting with someone on Facebook or uh, laughing at, on certain videos. So it is always important to have your social media channels organized. We cannot tell you what to post and what not to post, um, as this is your right to do, but we can give you the, an advice uh, that you don't post everything that comes onto your mind, especially if you, if you will make it one day, there will be people who will look into your past and if they find any posts that are not appropriate, it can come and to hunt you down and you don't uh, really need that kind of exposure. So what you do here is just copy the links of your, of your profiles on Facebook, on Instagram, also Twitter. And uh, the last, you have uh, the press, which is uh, if you have any articles written about you, you can search for them for the press online and pass the link into the bracket and just click press. For example, we have here a site where Albi is mentioned. So we will just mark it and put it down. So we have add press and you will press save okay don't forget to press save so now this is enough uh, for you to get on the players list uh, and be visible to, to the scouts and agents and this is the maximum what you can do with your free profile this is now your passport your football CV. 
So you need to log in uh, weekly in order to keep your profile on the players list. But uh, now we will move back to test your performance. Here we have an, op an option uh, to upgrade your account. So we'll click here. So basically what we offer is the, for the 25, year, 25 euros uh, per, uh, per year, uh, this will be a tool that will help you expose your football uh, and this is also a minimum thing uh, what a football player can invest in himself in, for his football career. Uh, not only it will unlock the performance passport which will be seen uh, on your profile, you will also be allowed to participate in various giveaways which we will organize throughout the year. So you can basically get a uh, a trial worth 1,850 euros for 25 euros. So if that's not something to think about, I don't know what it is. And you will also receive the field of score, uh, which is your value. In free version, your profile will be without a value. Uh, you will be able to share your sport passport with the football world, which is basically like sharing your uh, CV for the job interview and you have to do it, uh, otherwise you don't get called back for the interviews. Um, you are no longer limited to only one market, market post uh, at a time, and also a number of messages uh, is bigger. So just do the calculations, more messages means more connections. And you will be promoted in weekly emails, which we send out to our partner clubs uh, and beyond, and you will not have to weekly activate uh, uh, your profile in order to stay on the players list and this is all for 25 euros per year so now i would say that you learned uh, how to do and fill out the field of profile and why it is important for you if you have any additional questions you can always contact me and i will help you out with everything hope you enjoyed the video uh, if you missed it, don't, for, uh, don't worry, we will post it uh, on our YouTube channel uh, later. So that is it and thank you and goodbye.